All right, brakes on. Put that on here. View to chase. Lights on. We got blinky lights everywhere. Gotta have blinky lights. Okay, uh, we can keep an eye on our two and dun 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 contracts. So the contracts over here. We'll make our first goal to break the sound barrier. So our first goal is to break the sound barrier. We got to get up above 2,500 meters and go faster than 343 meters per second. That really should not be an issue. So brakes off and punch it. This thing takes off really quickly. Very low. Uh, the stall speed must be very low on it. Okay, so we got to get up to 2,500 meters. So let's do that first, and then we'll just... Oh my god, we're already breaking this. We're, oh no, we're not quite, but we're not far off. Okay, let's level off. Got to keep that... Speed, okay, so we just got to hit 343 meters per second. I do not think that's going to be an issue. We've done it, and it's got to, you got to hold it for like five seconds, right? Come on, I'm doing it. Let's throttle down a bit because we're going like kind of fast. Okay, what, what am I missing here? Your aircraft must break the sound barrier between 2,500 meters and 20,000 meters. Vertical speed less than 10 meters per second. It is. It's 2 meters per second. More than, oh, now I'm less than 343. 343 meters per second. Let's get back up to speed again. And hold it for 5 seconds. What? There's honestly... I don't see these things going green, and I don't see this counter going down. I'm going to count. One, two, three, four, five. I don't care. I've done it. If you, if you don't like it, too bad. I don't see anything that I'm missing. If someone in the chat sees what I'm missing here, then go ahead for it. But as far as I'm concerned, I've done that. I'm going to give myself that one as soon as I land. Okay, let's get up to 20 kilometers. So actually what I'm going to do, let's flip it over. Oh, wait a minute. It might have, oh no, we were over the sea. I was about to say it might be the, the, um, I might have to be 2,500 meters above sea level, but we are above the sea. So it doesn't matter that that is, let's actually put this now on sea level, but because we were over the sea, it was really irrelevant. Now this thing's got to get to 20 kilometers. So what we want to do is really pick up speed here. That's going to be job one. Yeah, there are some weird bugs. Actually, I picked up this, speaking of weird bugs in these contracts, because they are quite old. Uh, this one here to fly to 20 kilometers and then land safely. Um... I had this contract selected previously, and then I had a rocket launch failure that uh, some of you might remember. I had a probe, and uh, oh, there was all kinds of things. One, I, I think I busted all the antennas on it. I think that was the first thing that went wrong, and then I just let it crash into the ocean, and uh, I got over 20 kilometers and then crashed, and it caused this contract to fail, which just bugged me. Okay, we got to get some altitude here. So I gave myself back the money and reputation that I lost because the contract failed. I just edited that back in for me. And then uh, I, I uh, didn't accept this contract until I knew I was ready to do it. Okay, how are we doing here? We're up to 10 kilometers. That's not very good. Let's let's punch those afterburners. Let's see what that does for us. That's obviously, it's going to give us a lot more speed. A lot more thrust. I'm hoping this thing can get to 20 kilometers. I 
I'm looking at my Apoapsis here, just past 14 kilometers. I'm still picking up speed, so that's a good sign. Speed is starting to decrease now, but here, let's do this. Now, right, speed is starting to, yeah, now that I've pitched off a bit, this is now almost 17 kilometers. Come on, you're going to do it. You're going to do it. I do like these afterburners, though. They're pretty cool. So we're going to get ourselves up into high space. I should get ready to do a crew report or something here. I don't have to do it from here. Can't I? I think I can do it from here. I can do a crew report. Put that on standby. I'm not sure I've done a crew report. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. No, we need more speed. Come on, more speed, more speed, more speed. I've noticed... Ah, shoot, we're starting to go down. I messed up. Oh, I just came short. Ah, I wasn't paying attention. I should have been watching my time to Apoapsis. And I wasn't paying enough attention. I let myself get over the top of the hump. And now we're on our way back down. So I'm just picking up some more speed. And we'll try and see if we can... Ah! Horse Paluckies. Got to pull this up again. Start going up again. Shoot. I don't want to go all the way back down. Just have to come back up. Because the problem is now is that you lose three speed up. Uh, once you've lost speed up here because the air is thin, it's hard to kind of pick it back up again. Mine. Can you get up? Okay, we're going up again. I want to increase that time to Apoapsis. Keep pushing that up. Apoapsis is only just in front of me. I, I really worried I messed this up. just wasn't paying attention. No. Nope. I feel like I'm going to lose it again. I'm not as high as I was before. The way to do it is to pick up your speed when you're lower in the atmosphere and then go up. And I went up too quickly. Uh, and I don't think I have it. I don't think I have the speed to carry. No. You know what I'm going to do? Here. Do. Up, 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 up. Sure. I'm going to try it again. I messed that up. This time I'm going to concentrate. So we're going to we're we're just going to lose altitude here. Yeah, it might be the Panthers just aren't quite good enough. I thought they should be. But maybe I'm wrong. Let's throttle up and pull out of this. Crashing into the mountains would be a bad idea, Jeb. We don't want to do that. There we go. Okay, we're going to try this again. And if it fails this time, this time I'm going to concentrate and try and do it. It was really, it was very close. So, what I want to do is just really pick up, sp oh wait, I'm not even at full throttle. Full throttle. Let's pick up that speed. Faster you go. You know what I should do, really, too? Let's keep an eye on these. The faster you go, the more air is going into these, and the more thrust you should be getting. So 
So I want to build up all this speed down down here. And I mean, all these neighborhoods, they don't mind us breaking the sound barrier right over their heads. They're all used to that. Do I ha oh, I don't, do I have Oxidizer aboard? I shouldn't have Oxidizer aboard. If I have Oxidizer aboard, I'm gonna be mad. The these, you know, that could have, uh, John's mentioning about the Oxidizer, but that could have been what messed up because it might have seen this part, the bicoupler, and thought, oh, you have a rocket part, my friend, because this is a part that normally has liquid fuel and oxidizer in it, and that's why it might be getting angry at me. That's a possibility. I don't care, I'm doing it. Come on, let's, more speed. Okay, I think I'm pretty close to the speed of this. Okay, let's let's put on those afterburners again. Let's really ramp up the speed and just pitch up just a little bit. Want to not lose the thrust on these engines by getting into the thin air too quickly. I'm giving everybody below us here a show. And we're just gonna go just like this. I'm not yeah, let's I'm not gonna touch anything, I'm just gonna keep doing this. There we go. And for those people that haven't flown a lot of space planes, they'll get into sp Once I've unlocked, I think the... Well, actually, that's not true. You can build a space plane out of just rocket motors, but if you want to have a space plane where you use jet motors to get yourself most of the way into orbit, this is the ascent profile you kind of need to have. Where you just go up, like, I got it, what, at about 10 degrees here? And just, uh... Because you just don't want to... I'm actually even going to pitch down a little bit, if it'll let me... A little bit, a little bit. So you don't want to lose this speed. You want to just keep that speed building. Pitch down a little more. And then with lots and lots of speed, you should be able to pitch up and then get altitude. So we're up or close, but 854 meters per second. My apoapsis, well, is really just ahead of me. i got to be careful. I don't want to start going down again. I think I'm getting pretty close. Yeah, let's pitch up. Up, 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 up. And let's take that speed and carry it. Carry it. Uh, oh, that apoapsis, 23 kilometers, 24 kilometers. Now, now it's a personal. 25 kilometers. Now it's about how, how far can I get it? 26 kilometers on the Apple Apsis. We are over our, and this thing again is not going, oh, oh, what happened there? Oh, the engine is just flamed out. No problem, no problem. Thought for a moment I ran out of fuel. <laughs> okay, how high are we gonna go? 25 kilometers. There we go. How's that, what's that look from inside here? Like this is, oh, well, let me really look out the window. Okay, fine. Be that way. Nice altitude. Look at that. Okay, this is where we're coming over the top. We're coming back down. And again, oh no, it did say 20. Okay, this one went green, so all I got to do is land. So that one's happy. There we go. See, you can get the Panthers up over 20 kilometers. You just got to pay attention to what you're doing. That was my problem. Thin air means uh, not a lot of action on these control surfaces. <laughs> I thought I might get a nice view from the cockpit up there at the top, but no. No. Okay, now we do have another contract here. This is this flight school, and I got to go through some waypoints. So let's... Can I do this and not crash at the same time? Because that would be just super. Let's throttle up and pull out of this. So where is Waypoint Manager in all this? There it is. Flight School, Flight School Training Course Start. 
There, there's the start of our training course. So we just gotta hit this waypoint. And this is just flying through a handful of waypoints. Nothing, uh... But I do like these little contracts which give you specific tasks and then reward you with experience. So, just kind of reading over the, the chat, a lot of talk about yaw and pitch and mock and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> we can go faster, come on, faster. We can also do some physics warping here. Get over there a little bit quicker. Both Jebediah and Kim, though, are having a good time. They are definitely not phased by any of our inept, you know, struggle, our little uh, minor struggles, not major struggles, but minor struggles. Probably would want to slow down as we approach this waypoint, I would think. At least be subsonic here because I got a feeling this one and then they're gonna make us uh, you know go for another one so we're probably gonna have to do a tight turn all right Okay, so how close do I gotta go? Before you go, okay, there we go. Here we go, fly the course and I'll give you a medal. So I don't need a medal, but I do need a, okay, so I should have gotten another waypoint. Waypoint number one. I honestly think these are supposed to switch automatically, but I think the contract, the waypoint manager, what heading do I need? I need seven, okay, there we go, where is it? Is it below me? Oh, it's over there. It's five kilometers away. That's, yeah, I guess so, yep. Yeah. Okay. Get over to that one. Kim, of course, has to stick right now. Okay, that's the first waypoint. Go for the second. Waypoint number two. Below us there. Come on, Kim. Pull those G's. Clench those thighs. Get that blood staying up in your head. There we go. And, okay, okay, just one more to go. I've marked the third waypoint for you. So, training course finale, the heading is what? Well, let's give us some throttle. 160, 160 is kind of more this way, isn't it? Yep. Again, oh, on the verge of blacking out. <laughs> we need altitude, where is it? Oh my gosh. We're like, up, up, up. <laughs> All right, excellent. Just bring her home. Okay, we can do that. Nicely done. Okay, that one's already green. Don't need to land in order to prove my lacks of ineptitudes. <laughs> okay. 
Just bringing her home. Okay, let's put this back on terrain. I'm just going to let it go out into the water a little bit here, over the water, and then we'll uh, line up our approach for the runway. And I got a feeling this 20 kilometer one is going to go green, but I got a feeling this sound barrier one will not. But as far as I'm concerned, it had been accomplished, so I am just going to cheat, me cheat menu my way to that one. Now, actually, while I'm doing this, brakes. See, that's, ah, that's much better now. So when I push the air brakes, it doesn't dramatically pitch one way or the other. Or when I deploy those flaps. Slowing down here. Where's the runway? Any little throttle. Landing gear down would be a good plan. Line this all up. Eject, eject, eject. <laughs> That's what we need. We need an ejection seat, like when you are or seats on these things. Like if you, uh, and I know there's a mod that does it for you, but if you hit the abort, it just ejects your Kerbals and, and deploys their parachutes automatically. I think that'd be a, a useful feature for these planes because like if something goes wrong as you're coming in for a landing you don't have the time to fiddle to you know uh, EVA them and safely bring them down okay, let's slow down a little bit all right Still going. This thing I remember, like it took off at like 50, 55 meters per second. So we should be able to come in pretty slowly here. Okay, here he comes. Here we go. We're lined up well. Flare up. And. Whoop, breaks. There we go! Very, very, very little drama. <laughs> there we are. Okay. All right. All right. That was great. Okay. And I, I did get this contract, but not this one. So you know what? Alt F12 to the rescue for those people that don't know this here. And we are going to contracts and we are going to active contracts. And this is break the sound barrier. Where are you? We're going to cheat our way through the game. Where is Break the Sound Barrier? That is all those. Break the Sound Barrier is right at the top. Complete. See? And now it's mine. You're mine. You can't. You cannot. <laughs> you cannot defeat me, game. <laughs>